Hello everyone, welcome to our Let's Play series of Underrail. This is Colonel RPG as usual and I'm very, very happy that it shows to join me today as we try to get our bearings because this place looks uh, a little bit uh, dangerous. I was just going to check back here but there's nothing back there. So yeah, we're going here. I don't really know if this is a known area. I don't think it is. But uh, just in case there's something terrible on the other side, I'm just going to activate the shield there. Because there probably is going to be something terrible here. I didn't check. Nope, there's nothing. Okay, so where are we right now? Oh, look at that. You guys know where I am? No, I don't know where I am. I thought no. I don't... Oh, no, this is a bad idea here. I need to kill that speeder. I don't really know what I, can I need to kill first. Let's try and kill this guy because it's going to be a little bit... Easier to kill him. Of course, I miss. Okay, so enable the shield. Let's get going. Damn it. And I missed one. I, I can't miss a single one when attacking these guys. A single goddamn bullet. Okay, attacking that latcher over there. Apparently. Because uh, he's nasty. That speeder's not dead, but that's okay. I got a contingency plan here, and it doesn't work. Of course it doesn't, because it's not enough damage, and of course he crits me for twice the damage. Why wouldn't he? There we go. Off to a great start, aren't we? Well, not really. I really am not liking the difficulty here. Well, I I'm enjoying the challenge, but I didn't want that. By the way, look at our inventory situation. I got plenty of stuff. I... I got plenty of um, of space left. That's really nice. And I was gonna, I was gonna, I was considering my head if I should um, use grenades more, and hence the yeah, that I did there because I don't think I should. Let's also repair this. I am gonna be running out of um, repair kits. It's not okay. It's really, really bad. So I think we're going to need to avoid combat as much as possible. I think that's going to be the place. So we're going to the west from here. Uh, I think we're going... Yeah, we're going right. This time around, we're going right. And I'm, I'm going to really try and find my way around. Because I have no idea where I am. I need to find my way around. I suppose I must be... Yeah. I don't know where I am. Wait a minute. Maybe I do. Maybe I do. Let me... Let me... I think I know where I am now. Okay, let me see. I think I've been through here. Yeah, yeah, it's been a couple of days since I recorded th this particular episode. Uh, but uh, I think I've been through here. This is No, go away, go away. Yeah, it's fine. It's all good. I just, I'm just trying to see if I can... Nope, this goddamn guy. Can I shoot it? Let me shoot it. In the face. There we go. Die, little piece of crap. Uh, trying to kill me. Uh, but yeah, the, the idea here is to see if on the other side is an area that I recognize. Because I think this might be an area that I've been to. Uh, and, uh, no. This all looks not familiar at all. This is bad. This is really bad. They all look the same to me. They all look the same to me. This is really bad. I'm just gonna keep going south. Uh, yeah. My strategy is gonna be to go south, because I know the... I know the um, short dude is not going to be to the south, so if I can go to the south and then start from there, that's going to be the play, I think. I hope. Oh, this is... Okay, so we came from there, we have that exit, we have this exit, which I think is a little bit better, considering I want to go to the south. This is southeast, but I was pointing to the southeast. But actually, we're going east right now, so... What is that? Why am I seeing... Because I selected a guy. It's all cool. It's all good. So we got dead end. That's what we got. Let's explore. I want to avoid combat. I'm gonna save scum to try and avoid combat because otherwise I'm gonna run out of um, repair kits. I really don't want to run out of re repair kits because I believe I don't have any equipment on me uh, that I can disassemble into repair kits. So I only have. I only have two. Yeah. It's bad news. It's really bad news. Nope, you're gonna stay there. F you. I'm out of here. Okay. So going to the right this time. Okay, so let's go to the right. That's, that's a strategy. That's also a strategy. Keeping to the same side. Uh, don't remember seeing that, but uh, this might be uh, evidence of my earlier presence here. Although, spore infection, I still got it, apparently. 
Although, if I've been here, then this way is probably where I want to go. Ow, oh, there it is. We found our way. We found our way. Okay, so that was nasty. That is, there's stuff in there. I might check it out later. There's definitely stuff in there. So we came from we came from here. And that way we went. That's where the guy told us to go. Uh, so let's also check in here, see what that has. Because if it has equipment, I'm going to just disassemble it for parts. Because uh, repair kits are at a premium right now. It's a shame that we can't really go upstairs back. Back upstairs, we're... Kind of stuck down here. Okay, so we can disassemble this. No, this is going to be a leather stuff. A groin guard. Uh, let's give it a shot. I mean, what can I lose right now? Uh, and also, we need to repair our... You know, we need, well, we could go for this. Uh, so, recycle item. Let's try this one. It will give us fabric and uh, rags. And I can't really disassemble that one, which is not okay. But, well, I tried. I tried. Oh, where's my compass? I don't have my compass? There it is, my compass is on. So let's check down here first. Did I check down here first already? I think I didn't. Or did I? Maybe I did, but it might be a blocked passage. Yes, it seems that way. So that way we go, because I don't want to go through there immediately. I want to explore a little bit more. And I really don't think that would be a good that it would be a good idea to keep exploring those passages to the north or to the northwest. Because that would be, you know, the, the, the problem is, was, was going to be not just the ammo. The ammo is not really an issue right now. I brought a bunch. But um, it's, uh, yeah, I have, I have enough. I have enough, uh, hopefully. But the problem is going to be just the condition of the weapons. So, cardboard container, don't need that. Got the syringe. We got a switch here, but it's on the other side. It's not at that end, though. And this seems to be, oh, it could be the outpost. Oh, this could be the outpost. The um, abandoned... Um, oh, wait a minute. Maybe I can use flares to mark my... Yeah, I'll keep I, I'll keep the flares around. Maybe I can use flares up there to mark where the exit is. So, yeah, that might be that might be the play there. Just, you know... Okay, how do I get in there? I, can't, I don't. Okay. So, yeah, I think this is the, the outpost. Oh, there's a lock. There's a lock. The faceless outpost, the abandoned one. I think it's abandoned. Doesn't work. Dang it. Hmm. I don't. I can't really craft uh, TNT. I don't have any TNT. <laughs> I wonder if we can blow through this with TNT. I never tried it. I wonder if we can. Let's see. Let's let's pay attention here. So we got yeah. We don't have the timer. The problem is we need a timer for the TNT. Otherwise we just blow ourselves up. So this is not a way to go. So let's go to the north because we haven't been there. Yeah, I'm gonna use. I'm gonna try and use flares or items. I could. Use, I can just leave breadcrumbs. It should be okay. Items in this and just uh, explore a little bit later. Uh, maybe if I do it on my own just to see. Uh, you know, without uh, without saving the game, just to see if there's anything interesting there. And if there is, I'll show, I'll show it to you and uh, maybe not even keep the save or anything, but... Yeah, we're going north. We're going to kill this short thing or talk to it anyway. Creeping Dread. Oh, of course. You feel a deep primordial fear creeping in the back of your head. All offensive, offensive, and psionic skills reduced by 4%. So the longer we stay here, the worse that it becomes. As long as it doesn't spawn... Any enemies on me, and we got a Marauder. I'll take that. Thank you very much. Uh, even even though I'm just gonna disassemble it, but that's that's very good. As long yeah, as long as long as no enemies are in here, we should be totally fine. And as long as it, this thing is not like the thing that happens with the doppelgangers, because those are terrible. Pneumatic hammer and a galvanic vest. That's a nice quality one. I'll take it. Uh, even though my inventory situation is kind of in a, uh, a problem. Oh, we got a repair kit. Thank you very much. Creeping Dread. That's not going to be fine at all. Oh, look at, the, look at that. Oh, the Chorty is killing the Faceless? Hmm, just now realized that that was indeed a... Uh, that was indeed a dead Faceless. So let's use these over here. It should be okay to bring that down. Of course, the noise is not going to attract anybody. Got another... A dead Chortist. I wonder if this kills me. Hopefully not. So that lasts for seven. Yeah, it's, it should be okay to leave this place and uh, just remove that debuff. Let's take that. Uh, let's 
auto save right there. We got the medical locker. That did I forget about the medical locker? I did. Let's take these. Uh, lock picking eighty five. That's totally okay. I'll take the care of that. There's something here. So to the north we need to go. Man, this is a huge. It's an outpost here. It's like a, a village. Or, you know, like a city or something. Underground city. Okay, we got a blueprint for a chemical bolt that I certainly don't need. And uh, it's quite light, so I might as well bring it along. Advanced mechanical repair kit. Those are very welcome. Got shelves around. Oh, what is that? Eye of Trort. It's a point you real No, no, no. Get, get away from there. Get away from there. Get away from there. I don't know what that is. We're not gonna get... What is that? Old offense. Oh, no. Get, get away. Get away. Okay. The Eye of Trort. That, that's gonna be a fun battle. That is. Boy. Uh, so let's see. Let's uh, disassemble these. Get some, uh, yeah, some parts. I will... Mm, we're good to go. Let's go back. Man. <laughs> that was the Eye of Sauron. That's what that was. You saw the icon, maybe. Uh, it's very tiny, but yeah. That was not okay. Okay, Creeping Dread, there it is. It's like a presence. It's like a, a silhouette. So, that has some things. This had some things as well. Why am I so slow? Oh, because my food went away. Pendulums, a set of four identical metal balls, each suspended by two strings. When you set them in motion, interesting things happen. Yes, they do. Mutagen Halion 3. Acid, some acid vials. I'll not keep, keep that. Uh, what we have here, the IO2, some gasoline, magnesium powder, don't want that. Uh, I, off it, oh, there's a lot of pathogens here, or reagents, whatever those are. Let's also eat some barbecue here, that's gonna be the last one that I have anyway. Uh, might be able to find more, a gremlin stool back in there. Okay, so we're, 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 we're doing well, I suppose. We're doing well. I, I, I'm really kind of afraid that the Eye of Chort is just going to kill me. And I'm just going to be getting paralyzed. Because it said something about paralyzing. And that was not okay. Can this uh, be transformed into... Oh, I apologize. I apparently seem to have minimized my game. I pressed the wrong key. Um, can this... No, it's not what I want. Can this be transformed into not rags? Oh, there we go. Perfect. Perfect. Okay, so that's very, very nice. We're going to be able to craft a bunch of these. These are very important. Create, 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 create. Bring that in there. Create, create, create. Uh, put that there. Uh, sort. We got enough for two more. That's really good. Oh, we still have, still have more there. But we don't have enough for more. Let's create, create. Don't create that. And uh, just, yeah, take it. So the IO short is seeing us right now. I'm gonna save the game, explore a little bit. And if it kills us, it kills us. Otherwise... To keep going. We got a mine. We got another one of these. I will keep that just uh, as a. Oh, yeah, that's. I spend too much time crafting, and that's why the IO short has found us. It's found us. So 40%. Let's see if that increases. Let's see if that increases. No, it doesn't. So it's like a deep, a minus diva. 40% of all the skills. That's okay. Yeah, it's not too bad. I don't think. I don't need grenades for right now. Hi. Can I shoot it? I can. It's a scanner. Uh. Whoa. I missed everything? Oh! Right. How's it going, man? Can I just kill you? Is that a thing that I can, uh, can do right now? Can. Okay. So apparently I am inhibited right now. Let's get out of here. Let's get out of this junk hole. Man. Get, get, get away, get away. Why are you so slow? Because you're carrying too much. That's right. Even though you have eight barbecue. I, I, the problem, the, what happened is I just brought so much stuff because I want to sell it. Or I want to have it, basically. Um, that's the problem right there. So if I could find some uh, infectious spores here, that would be amazing, because that way I'm going to be able to heal basically for free. I don't think there's any here, though. These don't count, do they? No, they don't. 
Okay, well, let's not heal for free. Uh, take care of that. Take care of that. Take care of that right there. Well, it's not for free, but it's nearly for free. I did spend a bunch of uh, healing supplies before for no reason. Uh, it's a good thing we got so many from the uh, from the tortoise, though. Uh, mm, let's wait for another one. Yeah, let's wait a little bit. Uh, so let's uh, destroy these. Need that. Recycle. And I want to make more. Just make more. We need them. We need them so much. Get them over there. I'm gonna be. No, I don't need. Uh, actually, yeah. Let's split that right there. Create, create, create. And then put this in there. And put this in there. And we're good. Now let's seal again with one of these. And let's equip this, and we're good to go. Let's... Uh, that's good. We're good. We're doing well. We're doing well. I could leave some stuff behind, but I don't know if I'm going to be able to come back. So... Also, I wonder if that scanner was a, was there to begin with, or if he came around because I had the... Uh, or Yeah, they're easy to kill, though. I Probably I'm not going uh, to be wasting too many bullets on them. Uh, hopefully. I'm not even sure if I'm going to go with a burst to kill them. But I wonder if it was because of the chort that they summoned or something. I don't know. Like the doppelgangers. So can I go in there? I didn't see this with locker. Didn't let me. Oh, I did. We're good. Okay. It's uh, creeping dread. That's okay. Not too bad. If I just make a beeline, get out of here. Should be... Yeah, I can't go in there. I can't go in there either. So let's keep exploring. Uh, if I make a beeline, we should be totally fine. Uh, although he did deal a lot of damage, it was very, very bad. Uh, it's a good thing that I am very buff, but yeah, let's see what he had. Uh, tumorous Chortling Brain. <laughs> I will not be able to use that, so I'll not bring it with me. Uh, so we got a Harbinger Bipod, I will take it. Even though I am overburdened, but it's fine. So we got a Footlocker here that's locked. Can I go in there? Th nope. Not through here. Let's open that. Let's take this. And actually, you know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to drop uh, this. I'm not going to be able to use them. I'm going to drop that. So I'm also going to drop... Uh, I have something else that's very heavy. If Rater if Mateos had. It's very heavy. Uh, but, yeah. I have these. These are not needed. So let's just drop them. And that's gonna be the play here. I'm gonna come back for the side things if I can, if I can, but not right now. Let's check these two barrels here. So, that scared me. That honestly scared me. I didn't mean to do that. Hopefully nobody heard. Because that's the thing that happens in this game. People hear explosions and shootings and whatnot. I hear something here. What? What is it? Okay. Yeah, uh, that's gotta be some like machines in there. We got a hatch, we got a desk, we got an advanced patching kit and some antidotes. I'll take them. I don't want to go down those hatches or anywhere near anything. Frag mine that right there. It's a good thing I have my detection goggles. Uh, so sh can't I go in? Oh, it's locked. Okay. Lock picking th 130. That should be okay, right? 115. No, it's not okay. Huh. Well, can't get in there. Kind of a shame. Yeah. I need to level up before I do that. It is a real shame. Why is there a wall that... Oh, it's like one of those... Okay, it's fine. I'm gonna destroy it. Destroy it all. Yep, there we go. I wonder if we leave this through here and we're gonna be able to get rid of the Iot Short. I suppose not. It's gonna be things in here. I suppose not, but yeah, it's not too bad actually. Things things are going well. It is not very expensive. I don't really need it. It's leather, so it's just gonna give me things that I don't want. Bandages, those I do want. There's an elevator here. That faceless foot lockers. I mean. Uh laser pistol, I'll take it, thank you very much. And the fusion cell, thank you very much as well. Take that. I know, the Aya Chort, the Aya Chort, all the time, the Aya Chort, who cares, the guy is just such, so needy, so needy, why I need so much, so much attention, who's shooting me, who's trying to kill me right now, a scanner, see what happens, hi, he's running away, no he's not, I don't know what he's doing, 
He's trying to kill me. I should be able to kill him, though. Mm, let's go with the critical first. And I hit him, and he's dead. Perfect. That was very nice. So that's how I'm going to deal with him from now on. Even with a debuff from Jort. Yeah, we should be able to. I don't know. It depends on the battle, but... I'm feeling that we might be a little bit under-leveled for this particular area. So we got another scanner. Oh, they're patrolling the area. There's... Where did he come from, though? Because I came from here. Let's get out of here. Because I want to explore. So, yeah, no, I don't want to have the Eye of Chord on me for right now. So, my strategy is going to be to dismantle this as soon as possible, but not right now. Let's repair our stuff. We have a lot of them, of the mechanical repair kits, which is amazing. I'm going to use that right there. I'm going to use a couple of these in here. I think one should be enough to bring it up to almost full health, indeed. And I think I have some patching kits that I could use on there. Some crappy ones. Did I have a crappy one around here or something? Mm, no, not really. Okay. So, yeah, my, my inventory situation is kind of a problem. But we'll see how that goes. We'll see. Can't really have... I, I need to be l less greedy. <laughs> I need to look out after myself, not after my loot. Uh, okay, so Creeping Dread comes in. That's totally okay. Because we're going through there. Not through the hatch. Okay. I can't move the camp. The, the, the what now? A devourer. Hi. I can't really see you that well. No. You are, uh, what's the word? Ter terrible. Yeah, I think that's the word. I am pretty sure that's the word. Or dead. Oh, yeah. You're dead. Oh, that's... I, yeah, forgotten. Kind of forgot about that. Uh, that one particular word. So, let me see what I can do about your friend. Uh, can I kill him? Well, I might be able to. 47% chance to... And he's dead. Okay. Whew. Nice. We're finding... Ah, what? I don't want that. Ouch. No. I'm gonna die. Where did it come from? Is this like each time you enter, there's... I will say goodbye to you, sir, and I will also die. Yes, I will die. Uh... Ooh. This is, uh, what's called bad. In, uh, yeah. Terrible. Terrible is the word that I used, but... That guy... Is he patrolling? What's he doing? I might be able to avoid him, but why is he here? I think who saw me wasn't the devourer, was the other one. Just having my shield up, just in case. Yeah, I think we avoided him. Whoa. Do they spawn each time you enter? Because if that's the case, I have screwed up myself up. I have screwed myself up, but we'll see. We'll see. Yeah, there's going to be more of the same dread around here. Oh. Um, let me disable the shield, because I don't want to come off as, as being, you know, mean or anything, so let's take these. Hey, how are you, how are you guys doing? One of the rest of force. Oh, it's shortest. Oh, lovely. <laughs> well, it's a good thing there's people in here, so we, there might be a way back up, but there might not be as well. But this might, oh, actually, this might be the bottom of the, um, of the elevator. We might have found it. Okay, so one of the Rassophores lifts his weapon at the very first sight of your indistinguishable contour, shouting for the rest of the guards. The Faceless, they are attacking again! Co what is that, Cull? Cull, fire, fire! Before he gets the chance to unleash a hail of bullets, he seems to so keen on unleashing one of the other significantly taller Rassophore guards uh, stops him. Hold it, brother, that could be one of our own. The edgy Rassifor slowly lowers his weapon while his comrade turns to you. You there! Identify yourself! Uh, so... Um... Um... I am not one of the faceless, I just need help. Then you are in the wrong place, whoever you are. We can't help you. Turn away and leave or we will open fire. S but, uh... But you don't understand, I'm a tortoise and I, and I come from the Institute. The, the two of them look at each other. Come closer, but do so slowly. Okay, let's approach the barricade. I did save before, but uh, now I think I have the uh, autosave. That's good enough. As one as you come to a full stop, I'll, all eyes fall on you in an act of great scrutiny. Where's your robe, brother? 
Uh, yeah, kind of forgot about that. Uh, yeah, only a needed would wear a shortest robe in the faceless infested caves. I don't want to get cold on the su on site. Besides, their attack on the institute was sudden, and I didn't have time to grab my robe. That makes sense. Short is evolution, brother. Uh, an evolution is short. Yeah. Good. Now, if you can. I'm not convinced, says the other guy. The inbreds surely know our, our greetings, brothers. Uh, brother, let's ask him something that only a tortoise would know. Something that will surely prove he's one of us. The taller Rassifor ponders for a moment before asking you the question. What was the last name the Biocorp Armed Forces Captain who escorted Iodine to Deep Caverns during... The last name... Deep caverns during their expedition. Only those who have read the original report can possibly know the answer. Well, I know the answer. I have read the, that. The last name of the Biocorp Armed Forces Captain who escorted Ida into deep caverns during their expedition. So, that wasn't that. It's Japanese. I would remember that, I think. It sounds Japanese, anyway. Ristofor, that's weird. Peter could have been. Draco is my name, so it's not that, that one for sure. Although, was it? No. I don't remember... A name that was similar to my own. I think it was Draco. See, brother? He doesn't know. He never read the original report. Called a faceless infiltrator. No, I'm good. No, no, no you, you're, you're st you guys need to die. But um, I, I'm going to need to be behind your, your lines before you do. So, hi, how's it going? Yeah. Continue, continue. Uh, I just need a help. I, say, I just said I'm not one of the faceless. Oh, yeah, okay. I, I didn't say I'm not one of the shortest. Uh, so I'm a tortoise, and I come from the Institute, approach the barricade. Yeah, let's try this again. I... It's just, I don't know, I... Uh, it's coming up to the end of the episode, so... So, let's see. So, Ristofor is weird. Peter could be it, but that's too general. Braddock... Giacomo! Giacomo! Was it Giacomo? That, now, that name sounds familiar, but... Well, I'll give it a try, and if it's not, well... Ah, well. We're at the end of the episode. We're gonna check. I'm gonna check uh, my previous footage and I'll see. But let's see. Yeah, it's not. Okay, well, I could kill them. That's the thing I can do, for sure. Although I need my shield up. Although I'm missing a lot, though. But I want their help. I don't really want to kill them. Okay. Ouch. Ouch. That's the turret right there. Uh, yeah, I couldn't probably kill them. But, yeah. For right now, I think I'm gonna have to say goodbye. And I'm gonna look at, uh, whoever's name it is right there. But for now, I'm Colonel RPG, and this has been Underrail. I really, really hope you've enjoyed it. And if you did, go ahead and leave a comment, like the video, but above all, thank you so much for watching. And I hope I'll see you next episode. Bye-bye.